Alright, we have a massive storm rolling in here in Hicksville. We're heading over to the train station to view it. Just saw lightning off to the west. We're going to try to get ourselves a better view. Here's the storm again. See it approaching. Okay, here's a look at the sky here. Looks pretty threatening. Now, last time I checked the radar, there was a severe thunderstorm warning in effect for Manhattan, Brooklyn, and Queens. So I'm guessing that's the storm over there that's warned. We have another storm over here, though. You could clearly see the rain shaft again. So here we go. This is what it's looking like off to the west. You can see there's something off. The, it's darker than this camera actually says it is. You can see that over there. But there is still a warning out for that storm. Another train coming in. A Huntington train. Well, there are a lot of trains that pass through here, too. But they're, they're much more crowded. Yeah, you can see people standing. It's not like it's not like when we filmed the thunderstorm on the Babylon line, but it's down there. That's where it is. And then there's another something else over there too. It's a much smaller cell over there. But the severe one is off to our west. Yeah, I think that's a little more realistic as far as how dark it is. That's about right. Here are some rumbles of thunder. Down there, that's where the storm is. See the shelf over there. You can see the shelf starting to take shape. You can see the shelf trying to start to take shape over there. So this one's going to be approaching from the west. coming. You can see it down there. That's still over west of Nassau, so it's still got a little ways to come. This is more interesting. Take a look at this uh, rain shaft over here. Again. again, we've seen these rain shafts. Like, you usually don't see that here. And I spoke with one of my friends, and he's like, the weather's like Florida lately. I'm like, yeah, I know it's like Florida. <laughs> this is what happens when you have higher humidity. This is the climate that the summers are going to be now uh, here on Long Island for a good four or five months out of the year. This is going to be our climate. I'm hearing thunder, but I'm not seeing any lightning. It's one, uh, that's definitely a shelf cloud over there, so that's, I'm thinking that's where the storm is right now. This is a severe warm storm that is off to our west right now, uh, that is approaching us. I'm hearing thunder too. It's in the clouds actually above me, just to our north. Not seeing any lightning, which is weird. It must be up in the clouds somewhere. But uh, look at that. That's a really cool looking cloud. For us. Here is what it is off to our north, and I can see that rain. We're getting a little bit of rain from this rain shield over here. Just a little bit of rain. It's a couple of big drops of rain, and that's it. This sky, though, is something else. little bit because it could pour. Look over here. I mean, just look at the colors in the sky. Looks like we're going to have a front row seat to the best show on earth from Mother Nature. <laughs> All right, there was lightning. So lightning. Look, look at the sky. Look at the sky. Look at that beautiful shelf cloud over there. Closer. 
Alright, that came from that direction. The storms get closer. And look at this shelf cloud here. Look at the form on this thing. Look at this thing. I see the maddest clouds over there too, by the way. So this is a severe thunderstorm right here that's, that's coming in. This is a severe thunderstorm. Right, look at this. Look at this cloud. Look at this cloud here. That, this is the kind of cloud you see when you're in the Midwest. You see it's got that circular shape to it. That's a severe storm right there. This is going to be bad, folks. This is going to be bad. Here's a look at the radar. It's holding together. It's holding together. Oh my god, that guy's taking a leak. Do you believe that? He's taking a leak right on the platform. He's going to leave us. You know, this is what's happening in the middle of the island, man. It is going sped so fast. I'm telling you. I, you know, that just happened. Right? That guy just took a piss right here. This, look, look, see? You see that? This is what we got to deal with in the middle of the island. This angry looking storm is really scary. Look at the shelf cloud. Unfortunately, this train is going to park here and block our view to the north, which is really annoying. If it's an M3, I'll get on the next train, but I, I don't think it's going to be an M3. So we're not going to get a view. We're not going to be able to watch the storm. Look at this cloud, though. If this train's in the way, I'm going to walk over there. If he can take a piss, I can walk over there and film the storm. That's the way I look at it. Let's go. I don't care. If he can take a piss, I can go over here and get a picture of this beautiful shelf cloud. That's exactly what I'm doing. Look at this, look at this thing. I'm back over here now. I don't know why they put this at the gate here, but it's gonna rain shortly. This is the this is the shelf right here. This is it. I'm at full wide on this camera. So ominous looking. Look at it. Look at this thing. Holy cow. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. This is really, really bad. This, let's look at this cloud. And then we'll look over here. The sun's coming out. Anyway, it's going to pour any minute. Let's get to get our way over to shelter here. It's going to pour any minute. That cloud was, man, that cloud was impressive. That was one of the most beautiful shelf clouds I've ever seen. Look at this thing. Look at this thing. It's coming. See it down there. Start raining. Starting to rain right now. Oh, nothing severe. It's pouring. It's pouring. trying to stay dry right now. The sun is out though, that's weird. I don't know, it's really strong winds. It's pouring. Uh, the winds is all wet, I don't think we don't see anything. It's really coming down.
train. We're going to ride through it. I think it's mostly... Oh, there's another bolt over there off to our south. Right, it's going to pass through. It's moving really quickly. It's off to our south now. Still managed to get soaked, even though we had canopies, because the wind is just... The wind is just blowing so hard. It's a pretty strong wind gust for that storm. Sorry, I couldn't really roll the video. The cameras kept getting wet. I haven't even been on so dry out. See, there's a storm over there. Oh, there's lightning back over there in that direction. Oh, you can actually hear it. You just... Oh, look, there's a rainbow. You can see. I would just get on this train. In case service winds up getting suspended. Let's get out of here. The good thing is the storm is passing us now, so that'll be it. That was impressive. Oh, well, you take a look at this. Here's the storm. It's leaving us. It was a beautiful rainbow. It kind of dissipated. I was able to get a very brief picture of it, but look at the storm. Oh, you can see the rainbow over there. Look. I don't know if you can see it. There it is. And there's a plane flying right through it. I'm telling you, Mother Nature has just put on a splendid show for us today once again. It wasn't a really bad storm, but it was intense when it lasted. It was quick hit though. But just look at the look at this. Isn't that beautiful? Isn't that amazing? Look at that. Look at this sky, I'm telling you. Here's your storm. Look at that. That's like something you see out in the Midwest. Isn't that crazy? Like I can still see the rainbow. Oh, it is awesome. I just saw lightning over there, too. Let's see if we can get some more lightning. The storm's pretty far away from us now. It's probably over central Suffolk County. Wow. I'm going to watch this kind of move away here. It's very humid out here. I'm sweating like crazy, but uh, part of it's just from excitement. It's, I mean, I've never seen the atmosphere do these kind of things. It's absolutely beautiful. This is what the folks in Florida experience. Well, they are lucky. Like I said, I've had a couple of friends move there. If you don't mind the heat and the humidity, it is a beautiful place to live. You have some beautiful skies over there. It's known for that. As I mentioned, beautiful beaches that are free that you don't have to pay to get onto. But unfortunately, yeah, somebody like me, I can't deal with the heat and the humidity too well. Oh, it was lightning over there. I don't know if I caught that. It was lightning over there. Oh, my gosh. This is what it's like for folks who live in Florida. It's, it's amazing. If it was nighttime, we'd probably get some really nice shots when it's not nighttime. But I mean, look, you can still see the rainbow there. Not to mention, Florida is a lot cheaper for people to live. The amount of money you could pay, you pay on a house here, you could live in a mansion in Florida. That's why so many people are moving there. It's cheaper to live there. If you don't mind the heat, it's cheaper and you have a better quality of life. And you have all these beautiful skies that, well, the climate here is becoming like Florida. Minus all the good things about Florida, though. <laughs> rolling this. Just look at the storm as it's moving away from us. That rainbow is getting even more vivid too. I don't know if you can tell. Oh, and Florida has piney woods, too. Yeah, not pitch pine barrens, but the pines there, they have a slash pine and longleaf pine. Those are pretty. 
So like I said, don't blame people for wanting to live there. Uh, like I said, I can't handle the climate there. I'll tell you this though, Tom's River is probably worse than Florida. <laughs> it is. <laughs> oh, look at this storm. Kind of gets my mind off the guy that was peeing in, in Hicksville, right? <laughs> That's something you don't deal with in Florida, too. They enforce the law there. So the minute I stop this video, there'll be a really nice lightning bolt coming down from the top of that cloud. So I'll let it roll for 20 more seconds, see if that happens. It's not going to do it. Down there is One World Trade Center. Downtown Manhattan. Visibility is excellent. Oh, the storm is moving away from us now. I think that'll be wrapping up this video here. Yeah, what an excellent storm watching spot. Hicksville and Mineola are really good storm watching spots. Gotta admit, they really are. And, uh, on this, on uh, one last note, you know, we can't allow what's happening in the middle of the island to continue. Uh, and, uh, you know, I'm going to continue raising my voice, so, you know, not so much here on YouTube with videos, but uh, to my elected officials about what's going on, because it's unacceptable. And uh, uh, it's something it has to get taken care of, because in this future changing climate, the South Shore will be underwater. And uh, the middle of the island is going to be the place that people are going to have to live. We're going to have to live together, and we're going to have to put our differences aside and our preppy attitudes aside and our egos aside and work together as we deal with this changing climate uh, that uh, is going to be one of the biggest challenges to humanity humanity has ever faced and I don't know if humanity will make it through it or not. I hope we can. And honestly, this is what I love taking videos of, nature. And I said it before, I said it again, whether it be the Pine Barrens, whether it be weather, look at this thunderstorm. Let's see if we can get some more lightning out of it. I don't even have to talk, it's so beautiful. I don't even have to talk. I remember to give this video a thumbs up. That's another thing that's been going on that's been upsetting me. Thumb people who thumbs down my videos. I don't you don't see the ratings, but I do, and you know, uh, these videos aren't even rants. I'm showing you nature. Uh, if, you, if you're gonna, if you have nothing better than to vote down my videos, just don't watch. That's all. That's all I have to say because I know you're trying to intimidate me, but I'm just taking a video of nature. That's the way these people are. They just want to intimidate you. Oh, what's that weird cloud over there? I see like a weird yellow cloud over there. What's that? This video isn't over yet. I don't know if you can see this in the video, but there's like this weird yellow cloud. What is that? Do you see that? Do you see what I'm seeing? It's like this yellowish brownish cloud. That is the strangest thing. You can see it a little better now. do have another small shower over there. No lighting with it. I'm going to look at it for a couple of seconds and I don't want to get caught in it, so I'm going to be heading because a dragonfly flies right in front of the camera. Uh, but yeah, there's a small shower over there. It's uh, probably not going to amount to too much, but uh, what can I tell you? An interesting day. A very interesting day. Uh, an in interesting evening across Long Island. Once again, 
amazing show in our skies. Encore! Yeah, we got another storm forming off the south here, so we're gonna watch this now. See if this amounts to anything or not. Oh, the sky is, is absolutely, the colors in the sky are absolutely fabulous right now. I love the shapes these cumulonimbus clouds come in. You know, they're like the pitch pines of the sky, you know, they just come in so many great shapes. <laughs> and then you know that's what it's all about. It's all about those great shapes. This might put, start putting down some lightning. It's starting to grow. I'm watching this thing grow. And there's your sunset over there again. That's what I like about Mineola. We have such... Let me tell you something. I want to stay right here in Mineola. Right? Um, you know, I really do. I don't want to be live anywhere else on Long Island. Uh, we've got to get a candle on the, 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 the public safety issues. Alright? This is like the best vantage point for weather. And it's also the best... You, you know, you got to get to the Pine Barrens easily. Well, how are you going to get to the Pine Barrens easily from the South Shore? Pine Barrens are in the middle of the island. I don't know how much they trash and neglect the Pine Barrens. I love the Pine Barrens more than anything. Let's see if we can start getting some lightning from this. Oh, did you, was that just lightning? I saw something. We're going we're gonna to watch this for a little bit. As you can see, it's starting to grow. Isn't it? Isn't this cloud beautiful? Yeah, I think this storm is this is gonna amount to another storm right here. Definitely. So I'm gonna keep my eye on this for a little bit. Not leaving yet. The show's not over. You gotta stay for the encore. There's the sunset, which is amazing in its own right. Got these amazing clouds, and then look off to the south here. Beautiful cloud. It is getting closer, this one, though. This one might graze us. Take a look at the view off to the east, though. <sighs> Spectacular color. Rain shaft is coming in, folks, so I'm heading below deck. There it is, right there. You can see it. It's coming in on us. That's a downpour right over there. It's checked on the radar. It's coming in on us. So let me get over there. It's coming. Oh, look at this. Uh, look at this crazy-looking scud clot coming in. It's going to rain real soon, so about the thing here. So the rain is right over there. See the rain shield, it's coming right for us. Here it comes. Just a gentle shower, it won't be anything too bad. Something going on over there, I see the ambulance by the building. It's just a gentle shower. There's something going on down there. Just a gentle shower. Obviously, if you go out and you're going to get soaked, so that's why I'm not. Still raining, but it should stop soon. If you see over there... There's another storm forming over there. Check the radar. There you go. This is what's off to the south right now. Without producing any lightning, but the, these cloud formations are absolutely spectacular. The rain, as soon as the rain lets up, I'll be heading back. But, uh, just incredible cloud formation. No lightning, unfortunately. I was hoping we could see some lightning, but 
Can't have everything. One last look at these beautiful clouds and then we're wrapping up this video. So there you go. Anyway, that will conclude this video, so I want to thank you for watching. And uh, hopefully you got a chance to enjoy this show, the amazing show, Mother Nature has put on for us today. Thank you for watching, and take care.